Para 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 What's good, we're gang. Matt here. Hope you're doing well. I'm out here enjoying this amazing weather in North Carolina. Spring is in the air. Whenever you're watching this, man. If you're not familiar with what Prime Country Nights with Matt McCoy is, it's just seven o'clock Monday through Thursday. I just grab my guitar, jam one of my favorite Prime Country jams, and then show you the chords for it. How about this one goes up? Creole Williams live down the dirt. Tonight, <laughs> I'm sitting there jamming. A fucking spider just caught up my arm. I'm like, ah, <laughs> we go. It's one of those things. Guess we do it time. Y'all know what four chords I'm gonna use on this one? G. I think you got to capo the first fret. Um, if you want to play this song, this this guitar. It's um, it's actually a guitar from China. Pretty good little beginner guitar. Uh, it's called a Donner. They sent me this one. I just keep it in the back of my truck. So if I'm ever out and want to do a lesson, I can keep this little, put this little puppy there. So for the verses you're going to do, what I'm doing is kind of a palm mute. That's where you take the outside of your hand and just, you barely. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Creole Williams. Live down the dirt road, made homemade wine like nobody I know. So all you're doing G for four, D for four, C for four back to G. Then E minor, D, C, G. So G, D, C, D, G, E minor, D, C, G. Now again, if y'all if you're familiar with my lessons, you know this already. If not, you keep those bottom two strings. What that does, that stabilizes the guitar and makes the transitions really easy. So by locking up the two bottom strings, you can go from a G to a C to a D to E minor. For my G, I keep the bottom two locked to press the fifth and sixth, strum all six. For your C, which is really a C at nine, just move the top two fingers down to fourth and fifth, strum the bottom five. For your D, keep the bottom two locked, press that third string. And I'll get a lot of notes. Matt, that's not how I was taught, I'm telling you. Especially if you're a beginner, learn these easy ways. And then if you later, I want to do the regular D, regular C, so forth. But I'm telling you, if you're a rookie, start out with this way. And then for an E minor, you can keep your ring, both fingers, or sometimes I'll just use ring finger. I press right in between the fifth and fourth string. If you have smaller fingers, you can do fifth and fourth like that. But a G, D, C, back to G. E minor, D, C, G. You can do that twice. Then for that pre chorus, it's going to be D, E minor, C, G. So it's like it's going up the ladder. Got what you need, son. It's sit down in the cellar. Reach through the cobweb and you turn on the light. So on that last part, so you go D to C. I mean, D, E minor over to C, then up to G. But the last part, D to E minor over to C back down to D. So it goes like, Got what you need, son. It's a, just down in the cellar. Reach through the cobwebs and you turn on the back D light and say, Then the, the chorus is going to be very similar to that verse. Might be little dust on the bottom. I just did G, D, C, G. Then in one of those things, C E minor D plus C and G G G D C back to G E minor and D and C and G. So guys, strumming's, oh, I've said this a thousand times, but I'll keep saying it. Strumming's gonna be your most difficult part. 
So when you're learning these songs, you might want to just do down strums to get the timing. Might be little dust on the bottle. Don't let it fool you about what's inside. It might be little dust on the bottle. It's one of those things that gets sweeter every time. Oh, yeah, gang. Gotta love that song. I think I got this one on my four chord songbook. If you're not familiar with that, on countrysongteacher.com, I've got a four chord songbook. That's 40 songs that just use these four chords. And it helps a beginner. Because like I said, guitar can be tricky enough learning the strumming, all the chords. By doing songs with just these four chords, it allows you to stabilize that guitar and make easy transitions so you can focus on that right hand, the strumming. Good stuff, huh? Man, it's gorgeous out here. This is a little farm we have north of my house, about 30 minutes. That's about 40 acres. Uh, we're building a little cabin over there. It's my big Dodge Ram. Got my little excavator. It's just gorgeous out here today, man. God's good. I love just to get away in nature sometimes, especially all this, with all this quarantine and COVID stuff, just getting out in nature, man, and uh, seeing the goodness of God, kind of away from the noise and just being thankful for all God's given us. There's such peace in nature. I heard a preacher one time said the most important verse in the Bible is Genesis 1-1. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. If you don't believe that, then everything is a moot point from then on. In the beginning, God created the heaven and earth. Get out in nature today. Easter's coming up whenever you're watching this. Get out, look around, look at the sky, look at the trees, look at the animals, look at the wonders God's created. And be thankful. That's what Easter's all about, being thankful for Christ, the gift he's given us in this beautiful creation, but most important, the gift he gave us through the cross. Y'all know me, I could preach about that stuff forever. All right, guys, give the video a little thumbs up. Please share. Tune in each Monday through Thursday, 7 o'clock, Prime Country Nights. Let's go.